This one chemical ruins canned diced tomatoes. Calcium chloride is great at keeping plant material firm. Pectin in the cell wall is one of the things that gives plants their structure, but it's a soluble fiber, so if you cook it, it tends to go everywhere and the plant goes mushy. Mushy. Calcium ions from CaCl2 bind to the pectin, helping to hold it in place. That means no matter how long you cook these diced tomatoes, they won't break down to a good sauce. They just get kind of chewy and gummy. So this is two hours after it went in. Yeah, this is still the same. So it's not great for sauces, but what about chili or a soup? Do you want gummy tomatoes in a chili or a soup? I was very confused about all of this until I learned two things. One, they do this so that tomatoes can survive the canning process relatively intact, so you can still see chunks of tomato when you open up the can. And two, this paper, which claims that canned tomatoes with calcium chloride added are indistinguishable from fresh tomatoes when used in sandwiches or salads. Really? 